So let's just jump right in here. And what we want to go ahead and take a look at, you could uh, hit run. And this is going to take us right to the first entry point. You can hit run or F9. We're going to just hit run there. And that drops us into the virtual alloc. Something that I want to show here is that with virtual alloc, R9, we have 4, which is the basically the parameter that's passed to virtual alloc, and that has to do with the property protections that it's calling. We then go ahead and go in, and we're going to execute till return. This is similar to what we did in our previous video because it takes us into that next return statement after virtual alloc so that we get the memory address that it allocated. 